Yo, what's going on, good people? Never done one of these live. I hope it's, uh, well, I don't even know if it's live. It might be recorded or something. I don't know. I don't know how this works, but we about to find out. About to find out. I'm just in the backyard, shucking up some oysters, and I decided to drop in on you guys. Um... Hopefully everything is all right, and hopefully, uh, whew, just shucking up some oysters for the grill. It is Father's Day weekend, y'all. Happy Father's Day to all the fathers out there. Happy Father's Day to all the mothers who are doing the father's job, or daddy's job, or whatever. Happy Father's Day to all the uncles who are out there doing somebody else's job some good uncles out there i had some good uncles growing up hopefully y'all are uh getting ready to get on the grill and uh put some oysters on there and some hamburgers and hot dogs hopefully i'm sweating bullets Did some videos this morning, so hopefully y'all enjoy the future content coming out. And hopefully, just in general, hopefully y'all are uh, enjoying the channel and the content that I'm putting out. If you want to see something different or if you want to see me interview somebody in particular, just let me know. And I'll see what I can do to get them on here. Or if you got a connection to get me in contact with somebody you think should be on the uh, YouTube podcast. Just let me know. Shoot me an email at oysterninjapc at gmail.com. So just wondering, like, what's been y'all favorite videos out there that I've done? I've done how to shuck left-handed. I've interviewed the In a Half Shell blog, Julie. I've interviewed Murder Point, Pelican Bay, I think. Um, some great oyster shuckers like, um, George Hastings and Scotty from Canada, some great oyster farmers, Stonington kelp. I can honestly say I, I, that's been one of my favorite ones just cause I learned so much in that kelp interview cause I had no idea about kelp. And since then I've read the book by, uh, Bryn Clark, um, What's that? Eat Like a Fish. It's a pretty daggone good book. Um, he was like founder of uh, the Green Wave, I think it's called. Or Green... Is that it? Green Wave? Green Point? Something like that. But they help, you know, farmers start out. Basically give them the road map and every step they should take. So that's pretty good. Uh, speaking of books, I also read... Uh, um, the book by uh, Greta Thornburg, the 16-year-old uh, activist. You might have seen her um, scorning uh, Donald Trump with the look of I don't know what. Or you might know her from Your House is on Fire or Our House is on Fire. Um, man, she's really powerful. But I just wanted to check in with you guys. And I didn't know if I could go live or not, so this is probably just pre-recorded. But hopefully, you, hopefully you're uh, enjoying all the oyster content, and um, you know, telling a friend about the oyster ninja. Of course, I'm based out here in uh, the DMV, right outside of DC. Uh, if you're local, just hit me up. I'm always having oysters. But but um, until the next time, thank y'all for uh, sticking with me all this time. I've been on this page for a while, but just consistent, real consistent in this last year. And I can tell the difference in the subscribers and uh, just the views. All right. Peace, y'all.